Hello, on today's Crochet Corner, we're going to talk about single crochet. We're going to work single crochet through both loops, through the front loop, through the back loop, and also do a turning chain. So let's get started. On the first swatch here, I'm going to show you how to make a regular single crochet stitch. Regular meaning that unless otherwise stated, you're going to work through both loops of the stitch on the row below. So if you see here, there are two, uh, two loops here. On the, on the other uh, swatches, we're going to show working through the front or back loop, but unless otherwise stated, here we go. Uh, we're going to insert the hook in the both loops, yarn over hook, pull up a loop. You should now have two loops on your hook. You're going to yarn over and pull through both stitches are both loops and then you have a single crochet. I'm going to show that a couple more times. Insert your hook into both loops, yarn over, pull up a loop, yarn over, pull through two. Insert, yarn over, pull through two. Insert, yarn over, and pull through two. At the end of a row, before you turn your work to do the next row, you do what they call what we call a turning chain. For a row of single crochet, it's only one chain, so we're going to do chain 1 and then we turn the whole piece around and now we'll work another row of single crochet on the back side. Starting with, and if you notice here, the chain kind of looks like a single cro crochet stitch from the top. So when you've done that chain, make sure to remember to skip that before making your first stitch. So we're going to skip that first V and in the two loops of the next V, we'll insert our hook, yarn over, pull up a loop, Yarn over, pull through two, and there's the first single crochet on the next row. Do one more just to let it sink in. Yarn over, pull up a loop, and pull through two. On our next swatch, we're going to uh, work single crochet through the back loop only. So just uh, because this row is done, I will do a turning chain, turn my work, and then skipping the chain and working into that first stitch, but instead of working into both loops, just the back loop like that. Yarn over, pull through, yarn over, pull through two. Now when I work single crochet through the back loop or any stitch through the back loop really, I angle my work towards me a little bit. It helps in uh, giving you the right angle for inserting your hook. Uh, and yarn over, pull through, pull through two, just like a single crochet, but you're just angling the work towards you, inserting into the back loop, pull through, yarn over, pull through two, like that. Now in the front loop single crochet, which is this swatch here, uh, we're going to do just the opposite of what we did for the back loop, which makes sense. We'll chain one for uh, our turning chain, turn our work. Now instead of working through the front or both loop, our back or both loops, we're going to work through the front. We're going to skip the turning chain and now working into that front loop only. And what works for me is to uh, angle the work towards me a little bit so I can see and come up. See, we'll come up like that so you can make sure that you've only gone into one loop. Pull through, pull through two, because otherwise if the work's back here, you can think you've only gone through one loop, but be through both. So we'll just go through one, pull through, pull through two, like that. Now if you lay all three of these next to each other, you can also see what a difference uh, in texture you have from the regular single crochet, back loop only, and front loop only. The texture's different and also the height of the stitches. I used an Echo Blend yarn for the demonstration today, which is a great choice for a hat pattern because it's also machine washable. In this hat, we use uh, the single crochet through the back loop like we discussed today, and also use some of the other stitches that we'll talk about in upcoming episodes. You can find this pattern on the website, and that is today's Crochet Corner. Knitting Daily. Make time for yarn every day. Visit KnittingDailyTV.com for free access to all of the project instructions, ideas, tips, and techniques from this season of Knitting Daily.